yo what's going on youtube welcome back to another video and today i'm gonna be showing you on how to make these cool three try hard glitch outfits and if you're new here hit that subscribe button what are you doing gain good luck tomorrow and the rest of the week join the family let's not waste any more time and let's get straight into the video all right guys so you will need black joggers for this glitch so go to any clothing store on the map once you're there, go to the top section, go to sweaters, and you're going to need to purchase a black turtleneck. Find the all black turtleneck, this one. So after you purchase that, make your way over to the shoe section. Go down to sneakers and you will need to purchase black paint high tops. The next step is go to the accessory side once you're at the accessory side, you're going to need to purchase some gloves. Go to accessories, go to gloves, and go to black tactical gloves. After you purchase those, make your way over to the mask store. We're going to need to purchase a mask for this part. Once you're at the mask store, push right on the D-pad at the mask store. Go to the section called crime. So once you're on crime, you're going to need to purchase a black t-shirt mask. And after you purchase that, save this as an outfit one time. So it should be this one, the black t-shirt mask. So after you purchase that and save this as an outfit, still stay at the mask store. You will need to go to bulletproof helmets. And once you have bulletproof helmet, you're going to need to purchase an all black bulletproof helmet, this one. After you've done that back out from the mask store, apply the save outfit we just made and make your way over to the telescope. There's a telescope near the pier, so you don't have to go too far. It's right next to the roller coasters. So guys, once you're at the telescope, I'm gonna show you how to do this telescope glitch. It's very, very simple. So you're going to run past the telescope, push right on the D-pad, pull away from the telescope. Your mask should disappear like this once you got the glitch correctly to work. Once you got the glitch to work, open up your interaction menu, go to style, go to accessories, Go to helmets, cycle through the helmets till you find the black bulletproof helmet. After you find it, back out from the interaction menu and walk away from the telescope. And your t-shirt mask should be underneath your helmet like this. So once you got the glitch to work, make your way over to the mask store. So once you're at the mask store, save this as an outfit at least two times. I recommend it saving two times. But yeah guys, hopefully I did like this outfit this cool amazing try hard outfit let's get on to the next outfit glitch tutorial all right guys so go to any clothing store on the map go down to the t-shirt section once you're there scroll all the way down and purchase a crew t-shirt if you do not have a crew t-shirt you can always join your crew and one will be available for you so once you're on t-shirts scroll down till you find a crew t-shirt it doesn't matter which color it is, like the blue, yellow, um, purple, whatever your crew color it is, it doesn't matter which color it is. So purchase the crew t-shirt. So after you purchase that, still stay at the top section. You're going to need to go to overcoats. Once you do go to overcoats, you're going to need to purchase the fall clothes parka. It should be looking like a military camo like this. So after you purchase that, back out from the top section, go to style. Go to jacket and make sure it is on open. If it's not op on open, make sure you put it on open. So after you've done that, make your way over to the shoe section. Go to sneakers and you're going to need to purchase the peach plain high tops. Purchase these. They match the jacket. It looks very, very cool. So go to the accessories. Go to gloves and continue to scroll up till you find the 10 tactical gloves. Once you've done that, you can save this as an outfit. So once you've done save this as an outfit, make your way to the front counter. So you're going to need to go to outfits. And once you're on outfits, go to heist coveralls. It is called heist coveralls. And scroll down till you find the yellow hazard. It is called the hazard, but it's just a yellow hazard jumpsuit. So after you've done purchase that, you're going to need to do a telescope glitch once again. So make your way over to the pier. There's a telescope right next to the pier. 
So guys, you're going to spam right on the D-pad near the telescope, pull away from the telescope. The gas mask should disappear like this. Once it disappears like this, open up your interaction menu, go to style, and click the save outfit we just made at the clothing store. And back out from the interaction menu and walk away from the telescope. And your gas mask should be on your outfit like this. All glitched out. So once you, it's all glitched out, make your way over to the mask store. So once you're at the mask store, guys, this is an important part. Save this as an outfit two times. Once you're done, save this as an outfit two times. Back out from the mask store. Open up your interaction menu. Go to style and apply the outfit four times really quick. The saved one we just made. Back out from the interaction menu. And an orange little loading screen at the bottom right should appear. Once it appears like that, um, basically go to pause, go to online, go to pay jobs, go to rockstar created, go to missions. Go to a titan of a job. You're going to launch that mission. Once you did launch the mission, you could do this solo. So you don't need anybody for this glitch part. So it doesn't matter which difficulty it is on. Just confirm settings. Start the job. Accept alert. Start the job. Basically, you're going to load into the mission. And your character is going to have no torso. That's what we want. If you've done the glitch correctly, you should have no torso like I should have. So, once your character has no torso, once you load into the mission, basically make your way to the ammunition. So, you're going to go to the ammunition that's the nearest, closest to us. So, once you're at the ammunition, go to these outfit part of the ammunition. So, once you've done that, push right on the D-pad and save this as an outfit two times. Okay, guys. So, once you've done save that two times back out from the outfit section and you're going to pull up your phone once you pull up your phone go to jobs list and quit the job through the jobs list so quit out basically you're going to load into the session you were in and make your way over to the shoes section and you should have the invisible torso still like this so once you're at the mass store Push right on the D-pad. Find the section called crime. So once you do find the section called crime, you would need to find a gray bigness t-shirt. It is called the gray bigness t-shirt. It should have the word bigness on the mask. So purchase this one. After you purchase the gray bigness t-shirt, save this as an outfit one time. Once you done save this as an outfit one time, still stay at the mask store. So once you still stay at the mask store, you're going to need to purchase a combat helmet. So scroll down to you find the combat helmet sections and you're going to need to purchase a thermoscope. So the thermoscope you do want to purchase, it is called the Grey Woodland Quad Lens. Purchase that. After you purchase that back out from the mask store and apply the save outfit we just made. And make your way over to the telescope near the pier so we could do the telescope once again. So guys, this part's really easy. Um, run past the telescope, push right on the D-pad, pull away from the telescope. Your mask should disappear once you got the glitch correctly to work. Once you got the glitch correctly to work, open up your interaction menu, go to style, go to accessories. And cycle through the helmets till you find the thermal helmet we purchased at the the mass store. It should be the Great Woodlands. After you've done that, back off from the interaction menu and walk away from the telescope. And your glitch outfit should look all crazy like this. So once you did get the glitch to work, basically make your way to the mass store. So once you're at the mass store, save this as an outfit always two times. And name it just a regular name so Rockstar won't delete it. Yeah, guys, hopefully you did enjoy. Let's move on to the last and final glitch tryhard outfit. So, guys, on this part, make your way to any clothing store on the map. Go to the front counter. Push right on the D-pad. Go to outfits. And you're going to need to find the deadline outfit section. Go to the deadline white. You're going to need to purchase this one. It is called the deadline white. It is like 100,000. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. I think it's 190,000. But after you purchase the deadline white, make your way over to the accessory side. Go to gloves and you're going to need to remove your gloves. 
After you've done that, back out from the accessories, open up your interaction menu, go to style, and remove your helmet. So, after you do remove your helmet, this part's really easy, guys. Um, you do need to be inside of a crew. If you do not own a crew, you can always join a crew from like IGN um, if you do not have a crew. So, after you, you remove your helmet, all you want to do is open up your interaction menu, go to style, and change appearance. So, open up your interaction menu, go to style, and change appearance. It should be launching you into a room like this. Once you do load into the room like this, all you want to do is go to apparel, go to crew t-shirt style, and cycle through them, and find the solid white t-shirt like this. It is called the solid white. After you've done that, push B once, go to save and continue. After you push save and continue, Basically, just accept alert and it's going to launch you into an online session. So just push the accept, accept the alert, take the picture, and it's going to launch you into a session. And you should have Tron pants with the white t-shirt like this. So guys, for this next part, make your way to the mask store. Okay guys, so... Once you are at the mask store, push right on the D-pad at the mask store, go to head scarves, and once you're at the head scarf section, you're going to need to purchase a dark pattern wrap. It is an all black one, so purchase the all dark pattern wrap. It is called the dark pattern wrap. Purchase this one and save this as an outfit one time. You will still need to stay at the mask store. Go to combat helmets. So once you're at combat helmets, we're going to need to purchase a thermal helmet. So once you're at the combat helmet section, you're going to need to purchase the black quad lens. So purchase this back out from the mask store and play the saved outfit we just made and make your way over to the telescope so we could do a telescope glitch. This part's really easy guys. I'm pretty sure you know how to do it, but not the majority of people know how to do it, like new players. So you're going to run past the telescope, push right on the D-pad, pull away from the telescope, your mask should disappear once you get the glitch to work. Open up your interaction menu, go to style, go to accessories, cycle through the helmets so you find the black quad lens we purchased at the mask store. So after you do find the quad lens you purchased at the mask store, back out from the interaction menu, walk away from the telescope, the headscarf should be underneath the helmet like this, all glitched. Now make your way over to the mask store. Once you are at the mask store, just save this outfit at least one time. And once you're done, save this outfit at least one time. For this next part, guys, you're going to need a terabyte. If you do not own a terabyte, you can always tell a friend to help you out with this terabyte. And your friend could be AFK while doing the job. So... Request your terabyte through the interaction menu. Once you call up your terabyte or your friend calls up your terabyte, you're going to need to enter the terabyte. Once you're inside of the terabyte, go to this little touchscreen computer, push right on the D-pad next to it, go to client jobs. Once you're at client jobs, start up the job robbery in progress. Once you start up the job, basically just find and locate the duffel bag. It doesn't matter which Location it is located on the duffel bag. It doesn't matter where it is. Just basically locate it and once you find the location of the duffel bag You're going to need to kill off the police and the juggernaut But the juggernaut does have some friends in there with I think like two bad guys with two AR So be careful kill them off and also it doesn't matter if you die during the mission So if you do die, it won't mess up the glitch. So once you kill the robbers Basically pick up the duffel bag and lose the cops and make your way over to the yellow destination. I always call Lester to lose the cops. But this next part guys, you would need a flying vehicle. I prefer an oppressor MK2. If you do not have an oppressor, use a helicopter. So once you're near the yellow drop off point, jump off your flying vehicle, open up your parachute and basically you're going to glide into the yellow marker. 
Once you're gliding into the yellow marker, all you want to do is land directly into the yellow marker. If you do not land directly into the yellow marker, it's okay. You can land near it or like around it because I think this part I land kind of further away from it. But it's fine. It won't mess up the glitch. Also, just try to land near it as close as possible as you can get. So, once you land near it or in it, your duffel bag should disappear like this. Once it disappears, it's okay. Make your way to to the ammunition store so once you're at the ammunition store go to the front counter push right on the d-pad and you're going to need to find a parachute so go to the parachute go to parachute bag scroll all the way down and purchase the israel tube bag it is called the israel tube bag the blue and white one back off from the counter and apply the uh, parachute on through the interaction menu for this next and final part guys, you will need a flying vehicle, an oppressor MK2 will be best, or a flying vehicle, it doesn't matter which one you own, so make your way near the master, or fly really high near the master, jump out of your flying vehicle, and basically guys, you're going to need to jump out of your flying vehicle, open up your parachute, and glide into the master. This part's very, very tricky. So make sure your character tumbles into the mask door. So tumble means fall. So you want your character to fall into the mask door. So once your character falls into the mask door, keep on spamming right on the D-pad till the mask door opens up for you. So once it does open up for you, save this as an outfit two times. So once you're done, save this as an outfit two times. Back out from the mask door and walk away from the mask door and walk away at least 10 or 15 feet from the mask door open up your interaction menu go to style and I'll play the save outfit we just made and the double bag should appear on your outfit like this but guys if you ever do want to like change your outfit or you want to go to like a clothing store or ammunition or etc you do want to like go to a clothing store or change anything basically just easy way out and kill yourself with a sticky bomb or like just easy way out your duffel bag should disappear and you could change your outfit like that and if it does disappear and you want the duffel bag on once again just basically open up your interaction menu go to style and apply these save outfit with the duffel bag and the duffel bag should reappear but yeah guys hopefully y'all did enjoy give this video a thumbs up subscribe if you're new comment below what you think about this three glitch try hard alpha video if you all guys want more like this every single day let's get to 100 likes if this video gets to 100 likes i'll drop in another episode like this part two but yeah guys hopefully y'all did enjoy catch you on the next gta 5 online video peace